just got to wait for those lights to count down and then we can kick this off. Can hear the engines run high. There they go. Everyone's away. That's the start of round 14 in Monza. Looks like Riva gets a great start. T-Mac not so much. Dropped down three positions already. Now we all come down. There's already an end plate gone. But I don't see any major offs. So far, so good. We do have a sector one yellow flag. Major pain gets pinged for corner cutting. Can't quite get the car turned round. That's going to hurt. But nobody's off the track. So that's a tick in my book. Absolutely. Good start. Sector oh. 2 yellow flag. Oh, oh there's a massive accident. Mikau's off. No, sorry. Mikau's made it through. Any info on the league and races? Ah, uh, yeah, I can give you a quick snapshot. So we are AFR. We race here in the Oceanic region, Australia and New Zealand. Uh, we have uh, a variety of drivers. Our tier 1 races you're watching now is sort of our best of the best. And then, of course, uh, after this, we'll broadcast tier 2, which is more of the up-and-comers. Poor T Mac P3 to P20. Yeah. Yeah, it's rough. It's rough. Here we go. The beginning of the trains. Wahid will pull out to the right. Break on the inside line from Matoid. He'll take that. Have a look at Shrimp and Smitty both side by side. Smitty trying to take the outside. Oh, they're holding on, but the uh, Alfa Romeo makes, makes the break. No, Smitty will get it. As so they come out of the second turn. With Greeny close behind. Great job from the Toro Rosso, but it's still not over. Shrimp hard on the brakes as they come into the first chicane. Oh, second chicane, sorry. The Alpha takes the place. Oh, all right. Both that Toro Rosso and the Renault have uh, DRS, but uh, one of them's got that boost juice. He goes out a little bit wide on the Ascari chicane. Band camp's going to take all the time in the world. Straight past. Nothing he can do about it. Move up into fourth place. So, no. We have shitty internet. Oh! I just dropped out. I did too. Case in point! Perfect example. And Flyboy catch Wahid by the end of turn one. Oh, he's... Oh, he's going to go look on the inside. No. No. Because he's sensible. So. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do such a reckless thing? You can jump up here. It's a virtual safety car. Gus looks to take this outside line. But of course you cannot overtake. You have to be careful there. Oh! He's so lucky he ghosted. <laughs> Watching that timing there. Greeny should make the jump. On shrimp. No. Decides to pull back. Smitty elongating the braking that's allowed him to catch up Geordie is much slower of course on the harder compound Lotus looking for a way to get around and Smitty will be watching for any mistakes avoids an incident though and they all fall together we have a sector 2 yellow flag that's one of the Williams cars in the wall and it's T-Mac oh 3-1 oh. coming into Parabolica there's contact oh, and Geordie spun and Jordy immediately leaves the session. And he's also they're also on the slower tire. Let's have a look here. Lotus going on the inside of the second Lesmos. There's contact with the wheel, but no damage. They're all in the DRS zone, so Lotus is going to have a jump on Gus. Smitty's going to try and use all of the toe as well. We'll watch it from this perspective. Lotus will make it around through Ascari. He jumps up into ninth. Gus falls into tenth. Now it's Smitty's chance. Gets a much better exit. Gus has no choice. Oh, he's trying to shut the door as much as he can. But Smitty isn't phased as they move through Parabolica. They'll have the outside line. Is it enough? Gus decides to come in and cut it. Now, Gus will have DRS, but judging by those tyres, I don't think it's going to be fast enough. You can see the Mercedes desperately weaving, trying to break that tow line. Gus is looking for the attack. It's down onto turn one, hard on the brakes. They come together, but there's no damage. Oh, the wheels are going to touch. Forces him out. And Smitty, through all the carnage, jumps as well. 340 kilometers an hour into Ascari. Gus oh. locks up massively. 
Goes straight off the track. He can't do anything about it. Seb, what a bad rejoin! Oh. And that's put Seb in the wall! Oh, oh that's so heavy! Oh, that's oh and there's, so there's contact again! Oh, oh Wahid made the overtake on Smitty but couldn't quite get the clear. And Smitty's managed to just tap that back. Too bad. So Revo coming around the Parabolica and he will cross the line for the win. And that's him done. So congratulations to you. And now the rest of the race keeps going. It's going to blow Flyboy. up. Oh, it. Flyboy crosses the line. 0.138 difference between himself and Mikau. Oh. Oh, what heats off? Oh, and he takes me. Oh, actually, I Major Pay gets out there. fairly unscathed. Oh, God. Okay. There's so much. So much happening. This race. So oh, hard to keep track of. I, I didn't know where to look, dude. To be honest. I had no idea where to keep my eyes. <laughs> oh, it's bonkers. But, I mean, that's what, uh, that's what we try and deliver, I guess. All right. So, that is the race over of Revo taking the win. It's nice to see Alan Prost uh, coming out of retirement. <laughs> Mikael takes second. Great drive from him.